More talk from Mark Cuban, the owner of the Dallas Mavericks, about possibly running for president in 2020. Hey, everybody, I'm Chad Hasty, host of the Chad Hasty Show, which airs weekday mornings, 8.30 to 11 a.m. Central Time on News Talk 95.1 FM and 7.90 a.m. KFYO. Well, the owner of the Dallas Mavericks saying that he is still strongly considering a run for the presidency and that if he does run, he'll run in the Republican primary against Donald Trump. Reading from the Huffington Post, uh, Mark Cuban, quote, seriously considering seeking the presidency in 2020. If he runs, he could challenge Trump for the Republican nomination. In an interview on Fox News that aired on Sunday, the billionaire investor, TV personality, and owner of the Dallas Mavericks called himself, quote, fiercely independent, but when pressed to pick a party for his potential candidacy, he said, quote, probably Republican. Uh... When asked how come, he responded, uh, Mark Cuban did, quote, I think there's a place for somebody who is socially a centrist, but I'm very fiscally conservative, Cuban replied. Uh, Cuban also uh, said that he had not made up his mind about running, quote, I would not run unless I have solutions. If I have solutions, then I have something to offer. If I don't, you won't see me anywhere near being a politician. Of course, uh, we can't forget that Mark Cuban uh, endorsed and campaigned for Hillary Clinton in 2016, something that would probably uh, go against him if he were to actually run for president against Donald Trump in a Republican primary. Of course, some would say that's assuming that Donald Trump runs again for the presidency in 2020, which I do think at this point uh, he is likely to do. So let's talk about this. Is Mark Cuban really serious about this? I don't think so. I think a lot of the news media, they enjoy having Mark Cuban on. He's fun to have on as a guest. He has a lot of interesting opinions. Some I agree with, some I disagree with. Uh, he's a guy who is outspoken. He's not afraid to take a swing at Trump. He's not afraid to take a swing at any politician. When you're a billionaire, you can kind of do that. Mark Cuban is outspoken. Uh, he knows how to uh, bring in an audience. He's a smart businessman. Uh, he knows what he's doing. In my opinion, this is Mark Cuban, uh, you know, banging the drum for Mark Cuban and trying to bring himself uh, even more uh, uh, attention through the media. I don't see Cuban running for president in 2020. Uh, he's, he still, uh, of course, uh, has big things planned for the Dallas Mavericks. Uh, he's going to want a new arena at some point. Why would he let go of the Dallas Mavericks and let go of the different businesses uh, right now in order to run for president when he can jump on TV at any point and give his opinions that way? Uh, for Mark Cuban, he doesn't have to run for president. He can, uh, he can, uh, spout off whenever he wants to and the cameras will find him. I don't buy that he's even seriously considering a run for president, at least not in 2020. And a Republican challenging Trump in 2020? Yeah, I don't see that working out well. Tune in to the Chad H.G. Show weekday mornings, 8.30 to 11 a.m. Central Time. News Talk, 95.1 FM, 790 AM, KFYO. Follow me on Twitter, Chad H.G. Radio. Have a great day.